Alrighty, here at the psychiatrist, where I'm here really early, but I got a ride. I'm actually standing out in the heat because it feels good because I'm still kind of sick and the air conditioning is starting to get at me. Oh, oh, still got the sniffles, a little bit of a headache. Damn, not looking good. But anyway, I'm gonna see him. I don't even know how that meeting's gonna go. I'll just detail everything that's been going on with me. It depends on how much the guy wants to hear. I feel like just doing God math for hours, that, that alone could probably quali qualify me for some SSI, you know? Like, it's pretty crazy. Oh, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm also very drained because on Monday night, there's an activity. Last Monday, it was going to a baseball game, which I enjoyed more than I thought I would, but this Monday, it was going to like this place for recovery. Just a bunch of Christians with drug problems. It's the most depressing shit imaginable. And the thing is, you might be like, hey Ray, have some empathy. And I'm like, empathy is my actual problem. Because, like, when people speak, I can tell that they're not speaking with conviction. They're like trying to convince themselves and others and it's like just people with demons teetering on the brink just one bad day away from a relapse. <sighs> Sucks the life right out of me and I'm already sick but I'm just sitting there perfectly calm and still just like all right look like you're paying attention try not to let the depression of the room eat away at your well-being. And you know I mean <laughs> I tried. <laughs> just like, come on. It's like, I have nothing to contribute and nothing to gain. And it's just like burning up all my energy. I mean, I don't know, beggars can't be choosers. You get a free place to live. You get free food. You got to go through whatever thing they want you to do. God damn, I'm trying to get better here. And having the life sucked out of me, it's not helpful. Like, if you're going to talk about... God making your life better or something. Try to say it with conviction, or you're just gonna bum me out. And I'd be like, oh, well, there's a, you know, hey, at least they believe it. At least they're, they're joyous people. Man, they're just all teetering on the brink, though. And I can tell. It's supposed to be inspiring, but I swear, it's like the exact opposite. Like I said, you know, it's funny, though. It puts in perspective. I said that going to church is like going to Alcoholics Anonymous when you don't like to drink. And then the very very next Monday, it's like that exact thing. 